How's it going, my friends? This is Anakis, and today I'm doing a review for the Dragon Ball Evolve Jiren figure. I'm probably, I'm probably going to get roasted for saying this, but I have no idea who he is. I think he's one of those tournament characters from Dragon Ball Super. I don't know, I haven't watched Dragon Ball Super at all. A few bits and pieces here and there. But, uh... I like the style of the figures. I like the price point. But, uh... You see, there's the front of the package. Uh, it's a blister card with the artwork. And it shows the figures this way on the back. But, uh... Let's go ahead and open him up and... Check him out. So here's Jiren outside the package. He looks not bad. Kind of, I don't know. The gray skin tone makes him look kind of bland. Nice face sculpt though. And proportioned very well. Possibility his head can go 360, unlike the Golden Frieza, who once it got to like that point, it kind of looks like stuck. Nice little rocker there in the upper chest. And he's got a waist swivel. And he's got a belt there. Of course, the shoulders are on this weird uh, peg ball joint type thing. Double ball joint. I think it is. It does allow him to do a 360. He does got an arm swivel. And his arms do got... A, a single bend of an elbow. And his hands have all kinds of movement. And just a beautiful spread. And kick that far up. Kick go back that far. The pivot in the upper leg. A single bend of the knee. And it feels like a double joint in the ankle when you want forward and backward and inward like that, but it won't go out the other way, which is a bit weird. And you can rotate 360 as well. So, pretty good. I don't know much about the character of Jiren, but I know he was one of like, the top champions of his universe. So, still not a bad uh, opponent for Goku and his friends. Not a bad figure, pretty good. D definitely liking these Dragon Ball Evolve figures. They're simple, they're easy. Good, pretty good articulation for the $9.99 price point in your local Target. So, definitely worth picking up. I'm giving him a good 8.5 out of 10. Uh, my only pro a real problem with these guys is there's no blast effects, which is just me. And just up in the shoulders. While I like the range, all it feels like there's all this space in between them. Look at that. Wish they would have been able to do something better than that, but again, ten dollar price point, you really can't complain about it. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up down below. 
like, share, and subscribe. Remember to whack that bell for notifications. And just remember, keep hitting those toy aisles, and I'll see you guys next time. Later.